Que lo que mi gente, it is over. Seth Rollins is champion, actually winner, I should say, of the Royal Rumble. Let's run it real quick with this reaction. So, uh, Cruiserweight, Buddy Murphy, champion, still champion. I knew it, but I love the energy. I love the fact that they brought it in. Everybody, A game. Give that a four out of five off the rip. Uh, Rusev versus uh, Sinsuke Nakamura. Unfortunately, Rusev lost. I don't know how that worked out, but shout out to Nakamura being a two-time champion. Going through that, let's go talk about the SmackDown Women Championship match where it was Becky Lynch and Asuka. Now, that match right there it was definitely a 5 out of 5 in my personal opinion due to the matter that they just brought it in. Like, the storyline, the ep, the climax, the uh, the the whole roller coaster emotion. Great storytelling, and for that, I give them shout out to South Island. Uh, I give them that five to five. Oscar came out with the Oscar lock and just like got the W like she should. So shout out to her. Um, through that, let's walk talk about the uh, tag team. SmackDown Championship match. We're talking about um, Shane, The Miz versus The Bars. Now, remember, my mind was saying The Bars, but my heart was saying Shane and The Miz because their ego is too big and they need something to brag about. But good thing I followed my heart because they won. They actually won in a cool epic way i gave that match about a three out of five you know what i'm saying it was not very technical because of shame but other than that it was a real roller coaster type of scenario so uh i give props to them uh moving along to that we saw the ronda versus sasha bank now it it took longer than i anticipated but i still called it ronda with the w um, you know, Sasha did gave some type of a fight, threw up the fours and all of that when she lost, like a baby. But, you know, that's the name of the game. Ronda is going to, looking like she's going to WrestleMania and still as champion. I think her opponent might be Becky Lynch. Oops, my bad. Let me talk about that. The reason why I say the winner might be uh, her, she might be facing Becky Lynch in WrestleMania because during the women Royal Rumble, things were going tight. My girl Charlotte, Naomi got out. Mandy Rose was number three and she got out. Um, Becky was able to enter this uh, event because Lana got injured during the Rusev versus Sinsuke. So because they allow her, she was toe-to-toe -to -toe with Charlotte. And I thought Charlotte again was gonna win this match, but uh, I didn't like the ending. Becky won. So Becky is going to choose who her opponent will be. That's why I believe it's going to be Ronda Rossi. With that being said, uh, Daniel Bryan versus uh, AJ Styles. Not what I expected at all. At all. Daniel Bryan got the win with the help of uh, uh, Roman. Brock Lesnar versus Finn Balor. Uh, Finn Balor, you're, you're, you're good. I still believe in you. It wasn't your time. Brock is still champion. Yes, I'm really disappointed in this type of matchup because you're hoping that people like Brock, people like Daniel will learn how to like step down and let others arrive. But by Brock beating Finn Balor, it's more of a shovel and just digging him down so then he has to work himself up again you know what i'm saying it's like they don't give respect to the original universal champion when it was first given. you know what i'm saying they don't whatever and as you could see uh seth rollins won the men royal rumble a few things i noticed from both royal rumble matches number one 
All of them were mixed with current and NXT competitors. I love that. Only the men brought back one Hall of Famer, which is cool. I respect that. Other than that, given new opportunity to the New Bloods, loved it. Loved it a lot. They show their talent. They show why they work for the company. I'm sad Kenny Omega. They didn't do it, but seeing uh, like uh, Fair uh, Riley, uh, the captain, IO, I called her, she was going to be in it. Uh, seeing um, Pete Dunn, seeing uh, Alexander uh, Black, seeing uh, Johnny Wrestling, his wife, you know, in their respective Royal Rumble, seeing those type of people in it gave me hope that future Royal Rumbles will be good. I'm not sure why Adam Cole didn't show up to this event, but I, it is what it is. But Seth Rollins uh, was able to get the W over Braun. I know he's going for the Universal Championship because that's the only belt he doesn't have under his repertoire. Because uh, under his resume, he's been in the Cono, USA, uh, WWE, Tag Team, uh, won the Slammy, just won the Royal Rumble. You know what I'm saying? He has WrestleMania moment. He has NXT, you know, the first NXT champion. He has so much, like, a pube regiment. The only thing that's missing is the Universal uh, Championship. So, uh, he's definitely going for Brock. Is he the person to beat Brock? I don't know. Maybe Brock will be relinquished of the belt because he got internal injuries. Maybe. Maybe not. We'll see. But... I'm hoping I'll be at WrestleMania watching this event live. So that's my reaction. Uh, overall, I give it more of a 3.5 out of 5. Uh, the Men Royal, Mo Royal Rumble, Nia Jax, intern, like she's like the fourth female doing it. That gave it a little flavor, but still it's a 3 out of 5 for the women. It was more of a 2.5 out of 5. I felt like there could have been more element to it. You know what I'm saying? Because that ending was basura. Uh, so, yeah. That's that's my reaction. For real, for real. I'm about to go to bed. I got to be up by a few hours. So, love y'all. One love. Stay strong. Peace.